Hello guys, Glorious Chicken here from the Glorious Chicken Cube and in this video I will teach you guys how to overclock your display and it's not hard so it's quite really simple so just keep following as the video now uh, for your first step is of course just go down in the description check for the link and download it once you have done that you will have downloaded the file called cru.exe once you have that just open it up and it will open something like this custom resolution ability by ToastTX stuff like that okay so uh, oh, excuse me now all you have to do I uh, go to your first over here to the drop down menu you have to select your display uh, well if you have more than two display then you, well, you have to select the one that you want to uh, refresh add the refresh rate to or any kind of custom resolution whatever you want so for the second second step is that is a uh, well this is the st second step I think yeah okay whatever so let's go to the third step and that is a adding resolution with a custom refresh rate just go here on the add mark so before we do before we go ahead I would just like to say that you if uh, well most commonly used default refresh rate is the 60 Hertz so I, I just like to tell you guys to get, uh, keep adding 5 as you go on because I don't want you guys to panic because your monitor doesn't give any display that's why <laughs> don't panic nothing happens okay you can set it back to normal after that so well once you're on the detail resolutions just go to timings automatic LCD standard once you have it just type your resolution 1980 1080 and to the refresh rate at 65 it is the best way to figure out what your maximum capability of your display is and well I found it out the same way so I think it is the most effective one <laughs> Anyway, let's just add the third one over here. Manual, I mean automatic, 1980, resolution again. And the refresh rate, that is 70. Gosh, okay, there we go. Let's add the fourth one. Automatic, 1980, 1080, and 75. Simple. Once you have done that, okay, you have to click I OK. Once you have done OK, just be happy and stuff like that don't panic don't don't be nervous nothing nothing happens except you just void your warranty that's all <laughs> so once you have done all of it you have to restart restart your computer one so let's just suppose you have a restarted your computer just go to screen resolution by right clicking your desktop uh, and a <coughs> go to the advanced setting over here done it and the monitor right here voila so here is the uh, here, here are the three ones that you just added. So before we do it, I just like to recommend that you guys do not apply any of that because well, again, I don't want you guys to panic at all. So let's begin with our number one, and that is to a uh, select 65 hertz. Okay, let's suppose we have a done death. So you guys see it over here, right? Uh, it, it feels much much more smooth. I don't know if you guys can feel that as well or not. So I'd say do not keep the changes. Just click revert, okay? Once you've done that, and if everything is clear, not blurry, no flickering and stuff like that, that means you're good to go. Uh, at that given rate, it is totally fine for you. So let's move on with the other one, which is 70 hertz. Click apply. So well, there we go. Nothing. Everything's fine. No blurriness. No flickering. No lines. Everything's totally perfect. So let's just revert back to normal. For for the default one that is 60 hertz. So see, it is. That's it. It is that simple. In my, uh, I cannot go 75 because well my monitor doesn't support it. And if you guys do want to find the actual refresh rate that your monitor supports at most, I'd say, uh, well, cancel all of it, go back, open CRU, there we go. So let's suppose you have a 70 hertz for, in my case, that is a 70 as max for now, out of all these with the five additions, okay? So for example, we have like 70 maximum from the last setting we did. So the best way to figure out is I uh, just type, go to automatic manual, your resolution, 1080p, 71, 72, 73, 74, what? You can try it like this, okay? 
whatever you want you can try one by one nothing happens if anything does happen just don't worry just press escape everything will send back to normal and if even if your screen is blurry after being sent back to normal to 60 hertz you have to wait like uh, 30 seconds for your monitor to you know set back to the uh, default settings so it's nothing dangerous if you ask me so it's that simple well there you go that is how you overclock your display <sighs> So before we end this video, I'd just like to have you guys uh, read all of these things over here. Just pause the video and read all of it. <sighs> anyway, don't forget to like this video, comment down below if you have any troubles, suggestions or anything that you guys would want me to have a tutorial on and stuff like that. Don't forget to comment and subscribe because, well, that red button is full of glory. Others you're glorious. Okay? Glorious chicken out. Bye-bye.